the bonds that's built in training get solidified in the battlefield. And unless you've actually done it or experienced it, you don't understand it. You have a dog that did eight combat deployments. He did Silver Star Medal Honor recipient stuff night in and night out. He apprehended bad guys with weapons in their hands. He took beatings for you uh, when he got on bites. He found bombs. He roped out of helicopters. I mean, this dog was everything that should be talked about. It can be used on stairwells, it can be used in deep hallways, it can be used in tunnels, bunkers. The need to have dogs that were explosively imprinted and that would interdict humans just exploded. These four-legged dogs are absolutely, you know, to me, uh, the biggest combat multiplier we have out there. They can detect rust that's been painted over. They can detect cancer in humans. They can detect tremors. You know, what else can they detect? It's up to us almost to decide what they can't. It's not like your friendly little dog in the house. It's a dog that protects your life and you protect his life. This is a dog that will go to the nth degree for you. And that's the reason you get so damn close to him. This is a war dog story giving a voice to the voiceless.